Hi. This week I'm really learning the value of compartmentalization in this weight loss journey. What it means is to give each aspect of my life its own box and most importantly don't let one box spill into another box. Um, it, by, by letting one thing spill into another then you're creating a snowball effect. So in the past I would let one incident affect the outcome of another incident and then another incident and it would just spiral on down. So what I needed to do first was to become aware of the different boxes or compartments that make up my life. As I was doing this I realised that it can be as simple or as complex as you need it be, to be to work for you. For example, I could have labelled um, one box health. Well, for me this includes nutrition, exercise and vitality. The box head of relationships could have had sub-compartments for husband, mother, mother-in-law, daughter, etc. So for me, it's clear to have lots of smaller boxes rather than a few big ones. Um, the ones that I've come up with are these. Nutrition, which means to me, using, using each meal as an opportunity to nourish my body. Um, exercise, vitality, which means to me, keeping my spark. Housekeeping, finance, immediate family relationships, in-laws and extended family, a box for me which is doing things for me that I enjoy um, and then my bag, so working on my business plan, getting them up and running and that kind of stuff. So to give an example of how important this is, um, and this actually has happened, believe it or not, um, if I was upset with my husband, which is from my immediate family relationships box, then I would let my anger and frustration lead me to the pantry where it's directly affecting my nutrition box. But it didn't even used to stop there. Then I would wallow and feel angry that I binged, therefore spelling into my vitality box. Um, I would be low for the rest of the day and definitely not be motivated to do anything about what was awaiting me in my housekeeping box, let alone my exercise box. So. Until Giselle mentioned the art of compartmentalisation, I hadn't even thought about how one decision in life can spill over into every aspect of your life. Um, now, if we go in the other direction, which is the direction that I've been living the last few days, uh, it gives you a real sense of control. Just like one bad decision leads to more bad decisions, one good decision really leads to more good decisions. So what I have ha what I've noticed happened the last few days, um, all just from simply having a healthy breakfast, is that after I have my apple for breakfast, I feel like I've nourished my body. It gives me peace of mind, and because I don't feel sluggish, I'm more motivated to exercise. During my walk, I often do my meal planning, where I've got time to think about healthy, nutritious, fast meals. After I walk, I have a real sense of energy that I use to do a dash of housework. Um, I, I'm pleased to see my husband at lunchtime, because I, have, because I have a sense of accomplishment. He is happy because I am happy, I am happy because he is happy, and my children are happy because we are happy. So this way of thinking is a practice, but once you try it and see its effect, it's pretty easy to sustain. For me, the most for me the effect was instantaneous. So I hope this tool really helps you in your weight loss journey. Um, stay posted.